Reinhold Weber's Hard at Work. Kurti and Zag are two figures the illustrator has created over the span of his career. My name is Reinhold Weber. I've lived in Kassel for the last 20 years with my partner and our daughter. I work as a graphic designer and freelance artist. And Weber's work isn't just confined to his desk. Zag gets his exercise too. It gives Weber a change of pace. That's was. Weber has a unique style, just like his figures that are inspired by the fairy tales of the Brothers Grimm. The artist says he enjoys working in Kassel. I liked Kassel from the start. It's not a pretty city. You have older buildings next to 1950s architecture. But due to the terrible impact of the Second World War and the resulting building gaps, Kassel got the chance to reinvent itself. And so you have old next to new, and that makes it an exciting place to discover. That includes Weber's cartoon characters installed around the city. The artist's first recommendation is a relic from a bygone era. The rondelle is part of the fortification that protected Kassel from destruction in the Thirty Years' War. This is the rondelle, a fortification from the 15th century with nine meter thick walls. During the Inquisition, they used the Iron Maiden here, a torture instrument that pierced the bodies of its victims. Their blood flowed into the Fulda River. Today this spot has been transformed into a picnic area with a nice view, both up and downstream. And in summer you'll find tango dancing here. Summer's not quite here, and tango dancing is still some time away, but the view of the Fulda can be enjoyed any time. The river is popular with rowers. Reinhold Weber's next tip takes us to the Kunsttempel Art Center, a place for eclectic art events. Right now, an exhibition of language artists can be seen and heard. The Kunsttempel and the Literature House here are always good for a surprise. So you have concerts, performances, poetry and literature readings, performance art and sound installations. It's worth a visit any time you're in Kassel. The exhibitions are always changing. Weber has a recommendation for those looking for some good food in a relaxed atmosphere. The Herbsthäuschen. The Herbsthäuschen is one of my favorite places. You can escape the city and find a bit of quiet here and take a tiny vacation. All you need to do is go behind the restaurant and you're in the forests of North Hesse. The landscape around the Herbsthäuschen invites you to roll down the mountain in summer. And in winter you can do the same with skis or ice skates and zip directly into the Herbsthäuschen restaurant. Or you can continue on with a walk. There's certainly enough space in the Habichtswald Nature Park. <laughs> <laughs> 